Gray Kinnear. Hello. Hello. Welcome to Miami. Good to be back in Miami. I saw your film, Heaven is for Real. You play this incredible preacher, Todd Burpo. Tell me, what was that, what was that like, filming that movie? Uh, well, we, sh we shot it up in uh, uh, Winnipeg, outside Winnipeg, uh, last summer. And uh, Dean Semler, a wonderful DP, shot Dances with Wolves. I mean, made that place look like a postcard. It, it was like a character in the movie. Um, you know, I, I was brought this uh, script by Randy Wallace, who I'd worked with on We Were Soldiers, and you know, he's a great writer, wrote Braveheart, and he had really adapted, I think, a, a, a nice story. Um, Joe Roth, who was producing it, and he sat, who were very opposite guys, mm -hmm. you know, sat down with me and just told me what the story was about. And I was like, oh, that sounds like a good movie. And, mm -hmm. and I think at the end of the day, the, the movie is, um, it, you know, f first and foremost, I, I think it's entertaining. Um, I don't feel like it's, I, my worry always with a movie like this is it could be very preachy about, you know, you need to think this, and I don't think it does that. I think it uh, tells you the story, yeah. and and it asks, you know, you're, you, there's plenty there to chew on, plenty to think about if, uh, whether you believe that this is the show is right here on earth, or there's something afterwards is irrelevant. There's, there's a very human story here that is, uh, it's worth thinking about, worth talking about, and it was quite extraordinary what that family went through. I think the acting that you did brought us in so much. You were so believable that I could, you know, go see you every sun Sunday. You know, as a preacher, I think you did this acting job was phenomenal, and the <laughs> interaction with the family with the little boy for Colton. I think did you get to meet the real family and speak to them? I did. I, I well, I talked to uh, Todd a, a couple times before, and, and you know, met him. For, uh, I met him actually for the first time while we were shooting. Uh, which was like, uh, hi, hi, <laughs> you know, it was a strange, strange, uh, strange thing. Probably much more strange for him than for me. I, I've played some real life people before, but, um, you know, you, you try to get a, a little sense of, of who they are. I really like the, the notion that he was a, um, not just a preacher, that he's a father, he's, a, he's the wrestling coach, he's a volunteer fireman. I mean, he's, this guy was doing a heck of a lot in this small town and I think that generally that that is the way that it is I'm from a small town in Indiana and you, you wear a few different hats and and that kind of um, the sense of place is really captured nicely in the story did you have to do any actual fireman training to look you know, official well we, we <laughs> met with uh, we we did we hung out with these uh, but with the local fire department uh, guys you know um, up where we were shooting and they were really uh, you know took it very seriously and were very informative and and uh, uh, y you know they gave you a sense of uh, in fact that horrible fire that had happened in Arizona mm -hmm. um, happened while we were shooting on a day that we were shooting the big fire sequence on our movie where right. so Randy brought us all together for just like a moment of silence it was just a strange coincidence but you know those guys you know, as, as much as you kind of think, are they really, do, I mean, they're out there risking their lives. It's kind of a bold job to take on, and, and to do it volunteer work is uh, impressive. With all your different characters that you played, like one of my favorites is Sabrina. Mm -hmm. That's my go-to. I did not play the role of Sabrina, no, as you not. know. <laughs> but in Sabrina. There's been a lot of controversy <laughs> about that, and I want to clear that air on that. But you're such a good comedic, and then you can get serious, and you're also a producer with Rake. Um, your, what kind of hat do you like to wear more often? Um, I like to wear the kind of hat where I'm on a beach and it's protecting me from the sun. <laughs> uh, no, I, I don't know. I, I, uh, I, like, uh, I like variety, so I've been lucky to try a few different things, you know, in my, in my career. Um, but I, I think that's probably uh, uh, what's made it interesting for me is to keep mixing up the deck. We'll keep it up. Okay. Keep the work. Thank you. Heaven for Real, 16th of April, coming out. I'm going to see it again. Great. And I'm going to tell everyone to see it. Your acting was awesome in it. Thank you so Thank much. You more. It was a pleasure to meet you. Thank you very much.